Hi, I'm Michael Essick, and this is a quick video to show you what to expect from the launch of Merch by Amazon in France, Italy, and Spain. So yesterday, Merch by Amazon announced they are launching Merch on Amazon.fr, .it, and .es, or Freets, as those abbreviations spell out. Uh, the rollout is starting now, but it could be weeks or even months before Merch by Amazon accounts all Merch by Amazon accounts gain access to this. So in this video, I'll show you what it looks like when you have these new countries enabled in your account so that you can be prepared and ready to hit the ground running. So once these countries are enabled in your account, you'll be able to add products using the select product button that you'll be familiar with already. As you can see, the new countries are listed here. We've got France, Italy and Spain, and all the products are available except for the premium T-shirts and the phone cases. So you can enable or disable products as you wish over here. You can, you know, tick the boxes, as you know. Uh, from there, if we click continue, we can go over to edit details and you'll see the price list has now added these new options as well. So we've got France, Italy and Spain. Uh, the royalties are slightly different across all marketplaces. The base price seems to be about $13.80. Um, it is different, as you'll see if I, you know, you can see here these we put them all to 1999 um, in Germany that would be a 434 estimated royalty but only a four dollar royalty sorry 402 euro royalty in Italy so there are some different pricing going on across the different marketplaces so you can have a play around with that as well um, as you scroll down to the product details we can see the new language boxes so we've got new language boxes obviously for French for Italian and for Spanish so exactly the same as the German language box if you speak French or Spanish or Italian you can of course write your titles your brands your bullets in those languages if not you can just copy over your English over to these boxes and as with Germany you will need to have a design title and a brand at least in order to publish your designs to these marketplaces uh, obviously you'll probably want to list your bullet points and product descriptions as well but those are not required for publishing just one quirk to point out on the French one uh, the bullet points here are, are apparently coming soon so on amazon.fr merch shirts will not have bullet points on the on the live product pages but those will be coming soon so you'll still want to to add some details in there and that will be used once they do go live on amazon.fr so that's pretty much all there is to it it all works pretty much as you'd expect in terms of my advice when you have access to these new marketplaces obviously your best sellers would be the first place to start get your existing best selling designs over onto France and Italy and Spain and then of course if you have particular designs that would appeal to those countries for some reason you might want to prioritize those and of course if you can speak French or Italian or Spanish you do have an advantage over those of us who don't so I'm sure there'll be some translation solutions coming down the tracks but obviously you can write your titles your descriptions and everything in the in the home languages of those countries. Now there's no indication I can see that Amazon will be automatically enabling products for these marketplaces so you will have to go in go to your manage page edit your existing designs and enable them you know manually for these new new marketplaces and of course you'll have to go down and copy in your data into the new language boxes so that's probably going to be the biggest pain point is copying over your your data into each of these boxes for every single marketplace uh, for a solution to that I would recommend Merch Wizard which is on the free version of Merch Wizard you can uh, they have a copy and paste ability so you can go and just copy the data from your English and drop it into all the new uh, marketplaces so that would save you some time there that would be my recommendation for speeding up things on that side final Easter egg before I close out the video along with this update Merch announced that they've added language support across the Merch dashboard across the whole portal for French Italian and Spanish but also for Japanese so I don't think I'd be telling tales out of school to say that maybe that could be a hint of what's coming down the tracks as well okay I hope this video proves helpful if so leave a like and if you have questions, you can drop them in a comment below. Also, if you want to keep up to date with the latest goings on in print on demand world, so whether that's merch, Redbubble, T Public, Printful, or wherever, make sure you subscribe to my channel and subscribe to my free weekly email newsletter. I'll leave a link in the description below. 
All right, that's all from me for today. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon.